Hanover West, I'm Derek Landon. I'm Robert Ochoa. And this is your weekly newscast. Welcome to the Arts, Media, and Entertainment Pathway. Anything that is an entertainment industry or a visual industry would fit into this pathway. We have the visual art, we have the digital, we have choir, we have drama, we have band. It is arts, media, and entertainment, so that's very encompassing. They'll have a project that's integrated through all the classes, and it really meshes the whole education program. Instead of just math is math, English is English. They get to use all of those things together. And when you have a reason for learning something, it sticks with you longer. You do better. You want to do better. It shows how one class really works with another class and how one idea can be threaded through multiple subjects. The things that they may be studying academically work right in with art, the visual arts or computers or music at some point in our pathway and digital design and it makes it more relevant to them. I'm excited about some of the projects, having them produce something that they can really take ownership over and be proud of. I like art because ever since uh, fifth grade when I helped my sister with her first video project, uh, I found a lot of fun. What I love about art is being able to express yourself. If you think about it, art is in everything. This academy is going to teach students how you are going to make the real world connection. They're going to go out into the community and look for an art need. It could be someone that wants a mural in their home, a restaurant, a business that wants photography. They're going to interview the client, see what their budget is, work up a couple of proposals, then actually do the project in our room. The Link Learning Pathways are designed to give students industry-like experience, things that they may want to do after they go through high school and college. And Our advisory committee board is made up of several business partners. Theory is one thing, but you got to understand what others want and how you're actually going to apply that to your art. It's going to be a challenge, but it's going to be a challenge that you'll want to push yourself to do because it'll be interesting and it'll be relevant and you'll really see the point of everything. Hi guys, this is a wonderful art show that we will be participating in every year. Good evening, welcome to our first annual student curated art show. Go going to help yourself to the refreshments. So it's a chance for you guys to get your art up on the walls. The final step of creating art is being able to show the public what it's about. And we want kids thinking critically. We want them communicating with one another and collaborating. And I think through art, all those things can happen, definitely. My vision is a super rich artistic environment, a place where you feel comfortable to go to create, be yourself, share ideas, collaborate with other people. If you want to be with your friends, if you want the additional support, if you want to go on field trips, if you like working with your hands, then this is the pathway for you. This is just giving a student an option. It's giving them a course of study, a focus that they may just really enjoy. I don't see why you wouldn't. If you're into the arts and media and entertainment, this is a way for you to see how to tie those skills in math and English and art to something you love. It's going to be awesome. Don't miss out. <laughs>